Yo! What's up, everybody? It's Super Fly Fat Guy, A59, coming at you again. And I'm coming at you with a video that it's my reaction video, but it's also, it's kind of a video to let you know that, uh, man, just because a, a, vid a video goes viral, that's not always a good thing. And let me explain to you what happened. Um, for those of you that's not from this area, this is actually something that popped up in my Facebook news feed uh, recently. Um, Cincinnati native Adrian uh, Bronner, or Broner, maybe it's Broner. Um, he, I, I don't know where he was or what, anyway, he was driving down the road. Uh, maybe he was crossing the bridge. I'm not sure. Anyway, he was in Cincinnati and there's this dude. Um, Panhandling, you know what I mean? He's he's got a sign, he's got a sign or whatever. And I don't go to Cincinnati much. I'm actually from Newport, uh, Kentucky, which is right across the river. I don't go to Cincinnati much, but I'm, I'm fairly certain I've seen that dude before. Um, anyway, I'll go ahead and put a picture in now. And from that picture, you can see the guy and everything. You can see um, Broner giving him the money and stuff. But basically. He's driving down the street. He sees this dude panhandling. He says, "Look, I'm about to make this month this dude's fucking day." That's what he says. And uh, he counts out, I guess, like ten, one hundred dollar bills, and he gives the dude. He's like, you know, he and the guy was just the guy almost started crying. He was like, "Man, you know, thank you very much." He was like, "You have no idea what this means to me." He was like, "It means the world to me." And and uh, Broner was like, "Man, it means the world to me too. Trust me." He was like, "Just do something good with it, right?" So apparently, within the next day or a couple days. This video went viral, like it went off the wall crazy, right? Well, apparently people started seeing it in Cincinnati, and when they would see the dude, they'd be like, hey, man, let me get a dollar, you know, let me get this, you know, asking for money, because now they know he's got money, right? Well, uh, apparently four dudes or whatever uh, catch up with him, and uh, long story short, they beat the shit out of this dude and robbed him. He said that um, he said that he he had just he was like the next morning or something. Um, he was going to an appointment uh, to like interview for an apartment, uh, so he get an apartment right, and he was going to put the money down on an apartment and get his life on track. He said, and um, whether that's true or not doesn't matter. The fact of the matter is, uh, he said he only spent like thirty some odd dollars of it and got the shit beat out of him for the rest of it. Which is very, very, very true, or well, not true, but it's very possible, uh, because it, you know, that the viral videos are just, they do just that, they go viral. So, um, it just blew my mind, man. I was like, man, I can't believe, God, I just, <laughs> that sucks. Like, dude got a thousand dollars, and he gets robbed for it. You know what I mean? And it's like, man, what a piece of shit. Like them four dudes. If this, if by any chance this fucking video goes viral, which I'm, I'm sure it won't, but. Those four dudes, you are some bitch motherfuckers, man. You are some pussies. You are, oh my god, dude, a guy that that is down on his luck for whatever reason. You know, we don't know the dude's story, but he's down on his luck. He's out panhandling, and somebody gives him a chance, and he tries to better himself with that chance. And you fucking people take it from him, man. That oh, that pisses me off. Like, man, you gotta be shitting me. Just everybody's looking for a come up, dude. And it's not just Cincinnati, you know what I mean? It, it, and it, it, it's all over, but it it just pisses me off that these dudes just do that, you know what I mean? And they apparently, you know, they beat the shit out of him, and then uh, they played fucking what's that hot potato with his uh, with his book bag that had his belongings in it, including the money, uh, in front of him, like they're toying with him. Not only beat the shit out of him, but then they're they're toying with him with with his belongings, and then take off with it. And it just, I can't believe that, man. Like that, I mean, I can believe it, but I don't know. It just pisses me off, dude. It it just pisses me off. Like them dudes are some pussies, in my opinion. Bitch, go get your own fucking money. Anyway, guys, that's that's my my reaction. I just wanted to say, you know, not always. Uh, viral videos aren't always a good thing, not always, you know, we see the one where the dude gets kicked in the head by the guy on the train, and <laughs> the shovel, the chick getting hit by the shovel, that's all fun and funny or whatever, but sometimes they end in some shitty situations, you know what I mean, and it's, it, it sucks, man, it really, really does suck, because that dude could have very well 
went on with his life and, and did something good and, and, you know, had that chance that he needed. And he got it robbed from him. So that sucks. Everybody, take your easy, guys.